Let's start by importing the model to the composer. Going to File, Import. When importing, we can see a difference in materials from how they looked in our modeling program. This might happen due to different shaders that might not be compatible with the FBX export. Let's jump into fixing those materials. Starting with the glass. You can choose between giving a glass material type or a mirror material with lesser alpha values. You can drag and drop the material from the window and drop it into any other geometry to apply a copy of the same material. Same procedure for both headlights and taillights. Notice that we have some polygons intersecting. Minor translation can solve the problem here. Press 2 and move it along the gizmo. Have a yellow headlight frame on our viewport determining the render area. Let's turn that off too. Car body metal and other shiny metallic objects can look very appealing using the metallic paint material type, which you can see on the right window. Just the color as you see fit. Before we do our first test render, let's also adjust the rims and the tires. And let's change our environment HDRI to Studio Basic Black and White Lighting. Rims can also use the metallic paint type. This kind of material gives flakes, coat, and color values. Now we're changing the brake disc and the brake into metallic and glossy plastic. Pitch black materials mostly look very unrealistic with nearly no reflection. So here we just increase the brightness value of those materials. Starting our first test, we obviously see that we need more brightness from our HDRI. Can now work on more material adjustments. Metallic paint flakes seem to be very dense, can lessen the coverage value. The rest is up for you, what colors and style you need. Next episode we will focus on lighting and environment.